hey guys welcome back to my channel today we're gonna do a get ready with me at a hotel so yeah um i'm gonna show you guys the new products that i've been using and all that good stuff so if you guys want to see how i got this look that i do every single day then keep watching all right guys so we're gonna start with some skincare first before we even do our makeup um i'm gonna start out with something new that i was sent to me so this is a charlotte tilbury's magic cream so let's try this oh packaging on point feels very moisturizing but if you have oily skin this might not be the product for you only because it does it does feel like very hydrating so yeah so next we're gonna use this magic eye rescue yeah and it's also from charlie tilbury if you're into skincare and you don't mind like spending that coin, um, then these might be the products for you. Perfect. So I feel very moisturized, so I don't even know if I want to put like sunblock on only because i feel very oily and i don't want my makeup to be super oily so so next we're going to use this foundation and it's the smashbox foundation and i use it in the color 2.12 if you follow me you know that this is like my go-to foundation i'm like not really into smashbox like that um never been but ever since i tried this foundation like I fucks with it so i'm gonna mix a little bit of the dior forever undercover foundation i love this one too but it's just that um this one's too dark for me right now so this has got absolutely no type of light during corona so, so i'm just gonna grab this beauty blender and Okay. What's next? Who's next? Okay, next we're gonna do concealer and I use two shades only because one of them is like too light and another one is too dark. So we're gonna do the tape shape and one is 22 neutral and I concentrate just right here. I know a lot of you guys are going to be like, is she ever going to change her makeup routine? And the, quit, and the answer is yes. Hopefully one day. Literally, I use the same products in every video. So, I'm going to grab this tart. I'm going to grab the color Light Sound. So next we're gonna do some contouring and I'm gonna grab my Bobbi Brown stick 
in the color Cool Almond. Just right here. I used to do like all over my face, but I realized that um, I looked blotchy AF, so kind of stopped doing that. Alright, I'm gonna blend with this NYX brush. So I want to try something new because I just got it and um, I always use the RCMA powder to set under my eyes and if you follow me you know that and I know a lot of people have ordered it so um, I want to try the Charlotte Tilbury powder, the magic powder that they have, um, see if it's worth what it's worth. So I usually use my sponge for this. It has a little brush you can use with, but I don't know. We're just gonna use it with the sponge and see what this is all about. Okay. Um. It's immediately like drying my eyes, my under eyes, and when I when I feel that feeling, I automatically don't like the product. So mm, honestly, personally, I think I stick to the RCMA. And this is why I don't switch my products y'all that much because the ones that I fuck with, I fuck with heavy. It's very drying, so I don't know if it's worth whatever it's worth. I don't know. I'm going to check out the um, price on this, but to be honest, RCMA is really cheap and it doesn't give me that very drying effect underneath my eyes that I hate so much. Um, but once I feel that very tightening like situation under my eyes, I already know I do not like the product at all. So <clears throat> I will be sticking to RCMA. Um, if you like that, like if you're into that, um, well then maybe that's like for you, but I'm just gonna grab my RCMA and set my whole face. Even though I usually use like my Chanel powder for that, but today we'll just like use this one again. My eyes a little. Okay, so another new product that I want to share with you guys that I got recently is the um, 24 Hour Super Brow from Kat Von D. And this is in the color Taupe. So I like to do my eyebrows a little bit lighter, like I use a lighter shade because my eyebrows are already super dark. But I also don't like not shading them in, so I try to use like a light, light, light color. And yeah, I've been loving this pomade. I've been using it. Um, it glides on like super smooth. So definitely one of my go-tos right now. Like, do y'all see? Like, my eyebrows are already dark as fuck. So that's why I have to use, like, a lighter color. Okay, next we're gonna contour, powder contour. And I've been using the Kat Von D as well. 
Um, oh, by the way, shout out to Nas. I'm using her one of her brushes from her collection from BH Cosmetics. Super cute. I love the quality. Like the brush itself is like really fire. I love it. So, yeah, I'm using the shade and light contour, shade and light contour palette. Um, so yeah, I've been using this one recently. I'm gonna go ahead and sweep off the under eye. And kind of just like make my whole face even. a little bit under here and I'm using the metal shade by the way so yeah so I'm gonna go ahead and contour my nose with the same shade in the middle And with the same palette, I'm going to go ahead and do my eyeshadow. It's basically just like contouring my eye type of thing. So I'm going to use this Sephora uh, blush that's from Sayla's, but it's the one that I always use anyways, it's a peach blossom. Make sure you put a lot. Yeah, don't give her, don't give her hot Cheetos. Okay, we're getting somewhere. Now I'm gonna do my eyeliner. And so I love I love using the Kat Von D tattoo liner or the Wet n Wild um, liner too. They're both like really good. So we're gonna do a very snatched liner. If you know me, this, this is what I do. So I'm going to go ahead and set my face with the Morphe spray. Mm -hmm. Um, iced tea? The pure leaf one? Um, yeah, yeah. Uh, you can do the Sweden. Now I'm gonna grab my Bobbi Brown shadow. That is all fucked up, I need to get a new one. Um, but I use this to highlight my cheekbones. So I'm gonna let my face spray, whatever the heck. And so now I'm gonna finish highlighting and I'm gonna use this highlighter I got from J Cass, Cat's Beauty, this one. And it's in the color Crystal Sand. And I'm gonna use this to um, highlight like my inner corners and my nose. Okay, so we're gonna finish off by lip lining my lips. And I'm gonna use a Charlotte Tilbury's lip liner in the color Iconic nude.
Okay, so I'm gonna finish off with uh, this Fenty gloss and it's called Sweet Mouth. I believe this is like the one of the light ones that she came out with, so. All right guys, so that's it for my plus for my get ready with me um yeah i just want to show you guys some of the new products that i've been using to be honest nothing has really changed and you guys already know that i fuck heavy with like certain products but if i do find something that i like that's new then i will show you guys and share it with you guys um other than that um liz 